What's up, peeps? This is Get With It Sports Place, where you get your sports with a little swag. Here with my boys on the Two Cent Deposit of Sports. The topic at hand is Cam Newton and his big money. First off, let me introduce everybody on the panel. Almost everybody. I'm, I'm going to get them in, though. Everybody here is from Prime Sports Star Coalition. First That's off, right. we got the man of the hour, Big Q. It's That's right. TV. What's up, bro? What's going on, man? Big Q from TV. What's up, man? Panther Nation is with me tonight. I want you to know we we streaming live to the Panther Nation people. This is going to be a co-venture between Get With It Sports and Team Boy TV's Black and Blue podcast with, you know, with my prime people, right? Hey, I want you all to know Panther Nation is watching, okay? I just want you all to know that. Never scared, bro. <laughs> Never scared. Next right. up. No, oh, my God. Next up, we got Ezra from Idiot Sports Talk. Representing Jets Nation. Just, you know, just to let you all know. All right. Keep in here. Next up, we have Raphael, a.k.a. Mr. Controversy from the Three Point Conversion. What's up, man? I'm representing the Bears. I know this is an old jersey, but we don't care. Hey, hey, hey my jersey is 12 years old, bro. So, you know I mean? so. And last but not least, my boy, I pulled him out the, out the archives. We got Diego DeBrishnikov from AA Sports. What's up, bro? What's going on? What's going on, Blast? What's up, fellas? I don't have my gear on, but I'm representing Niner Nation all day. Appreciate oh, nothing, you dusting nothing. me off and bringing me out the, bringing me out the back. I almost stood out the closet, but it's too much Bruce Jenner going on right now. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Gotcha. <laughs> no problem. I'm glad y'all got me on here, man. Let's talk yeah. about this money. I'm just looking at the deal. Ooh, let's look. All right. All right. No problem. <laughs> just in case y'all didn't know, Cam Newton, go ahead and put his John Hancock down on the contract to a five-year, $103 million deal. Yes, it is. With $67 million owed to him in the first three years. Mm-hmm. So, he is in the class with the $100 million makers, quarterbacks in the NFL. There's nine of them. First off, before we even, even name the other ones, do you guys think Cam Newton worth the money? You I'm know what? I'm, 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 no, I'm, I'm not even gonna start <laughs> with BQ because we know what you think. I'm gonna go ahead and start. I'm gonna go ahead with Mr. Controversy. I know he's about to go just go all out. Go ahead, bro. Mr. Controversy. He Look, the money. I am happy for Cam. I think it's great for Cam to get this money. It's funny when you think about when he first came into the league, before he came into the league, all the scrutiny he had to go through, this guy would not be great he's horrible um what's my man from it from the full letter network i can't think of his name merrill hodge mm-hmm. called him trashed him so i'm happy for cam thank you but oh, i know what coming. in the world is carolina thinking <laughs> wow you give a quarterback this type of money when you all went seven and nine and you supposed to have you had the best defense and pump, your break. pump your brakes pump your brakes pump, and I, nine? I gotta Come stop on, you. Man. i gotta on. stop you what was what, what was Chicago's record? We're not talking Chicago. about Chicago. Whoa. I'm gonna Hold own on. that. I'm Hold gonna on. own that. Wait a I minute. I want you to own Cam Newton. No, 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 no. The no. fact Wait. that he's getting all this money and he's throwing the ball 15 feet up in the air, whereas receivers can't catch the ball. Listen, I'm, listen. I'm 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 gonna let you do your thing. But I'm saying since I got you and a Niners fan in the building, I'm saying I can I can say this. Okay, what was Jay Cutler's record when they gave him that money? Ooh. My point exactly. So you all are going to what was this record? Five Furthermore, eleven. So you're going five. My point exactly. Furthermore, Big what Q. was Colin Kaepernick's record when he got that money? Big Q. And you're what was Ryan oh, Tannehill's oh, record? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Go ahead. What was Andy Dalton's Dalton. record when he got that money? But Big, right. okay, Big Q. This <laughs> is all I'm saying though, and you're proving my point because yeah. that's where I was going to. Jay Cutler, Kaepernick, Matthew Stafford, Matt Ryan. When all of them got the money, what they do? The, the numbers went down, and they, they had a worse record the year after. So, Carolina, what are you doing? He had not proved himself. Come on. I'm going to chill until it's my turn to talk. Okay. Y'all, y'all kill, you ain't going to hear what you got to say, man. Cam Newton deserves the money. College is coming off a of, uh, of Super Bowl appearance. When, when okay, yeah, you're right. You're right. Yeah, you're right. And, uh, and, you know, the thing with his deal and Dalton's deal, too, though, I like the way they had the team structured it because it was mm-hmm. really team friendly. Team friendly. I think it ended up really, it's really two years, 25, 30 million. Then after that, it's kind of a wait and see year to year yeah. kind of deal. Mm-hmm. You know? So I kind of like that structure of it. But, um, you know, also we beat y'all last time we played y'all in the playoffs. Well, um, you did. You did. You did. <laughs> <laughs> you did. 
No, I got I got a buddy that's a Panthers fan, so I give him shit all the time too. Yeah. But uh, you know, sixty million guaranteed. This deal makes him the third highest paid quarterback behind Brady and Roethlisberger. Uh, yeah, that's that's that, that's a lot. That's steep. That's okay. steep. That's steep. Like my man said, for seventy nine. Yeah. You know, you really got into the playoffs by default because of the NFC South is mm. more like the Big East. Mm-hmm. Uh, but you know, hey, I'm, I'm happy you got the money. But I, I want to I I cut that check. All right. All right, cool. Yes. <laughs> I know you got to say something. Whew. You know what? <laughs> Is he worth being paid the third pay, uh, the third highest paid quarterback in the league? No. But does he deserve the contract? Yes, because the market dictates that. Okay, look at Alex Smith, a quarterback that gets his wide receivers zero touchdowns in a damn season, signed a four-year, $77 million extension yes. two years ago. Mm -hmm. Well, a year ago, okay, last year. We saw a couple weeks ago, Ryan Tannehill, $96 million. You know, it's just the market that takes that. And he's the third right now. But wait till Russell Wilson, Mm -hmm. Andrew Luck signed their deals. They're going to destroy this deal. So it looks like a bargain. And and forget about the money. How hard is it? Because we got a Bears fan. We got a Jets fan. We got a Panthers fan. Is to find a franchise quarterback. Absolutely. That's what I was on. Even, even, even though he's not, he's not a Breeze, he's not a Roethlisberger, there's only a select few of those. But when you have a guy that can lead your team, because he led this team to 12-4 and four record before, he is the offense. Think about the team structured around him. He's never had much weapons to explode, okay? Last no year, he has slow receivers. Now he's got a number one, but... His mm-hmm. number two guy's a tight end, who's the same makeup as his number one. His running back's got fifty million over the last couple years, and they have been unproductive. He has been the offense for the Panthers, so he, he clearly deserves this money. Mm-hmm. He's the right move because you want to keep this guy. You know what you're going to get from for years to come. Because if you don't resign him, who is your other option? Mark Sanchez for the next couple of years? What free agent are you going to suck really bad to pick up a potential guy like Cam Newton? Yeah. That's the thing. What's the unknown after yeah. that? You don't know. Mm-hmm. Right. He pretty much has summed up everything I was wanting to say, class. <laughs> it was it's a it's a matter, of, oh, you know, we shouldn't pay him, but we're gonna let him test the market. Somebody's gonna pay him, right? Right, right. And, and and to Ezra's point, this is what the market looks like. If Carolina said, Well, you know what, the hundred million is too rich for our blood. Well, you still got, you know, these other ten well, Tennessee just drafted pretty high, but you got some people who kind of looking for a quarterback who may have some money. St. Louis, you know, they got money, you know what I mean? I don't know. I think you lock him up, just like San Francisco did with, with Kaepernick. You know, it was a, it's more of a potential thing. And again, the guy got drafted number one overall, which means you got drafted by the absolute worst team in the NFL that particular year. It right. take a little bit of time to build a team around this guy, right? Um, does he deserve the money? Just like Ezra said, all the things that he contributed to this team since he got here? Absolutely. Ain't no doubt about it. Ain't no doubt about it. Right. I think it's a good look. I you think know what? Good. It took me a long time. Number one, I always, till the day I die, nobody worth a hundred million dollars. No <laughs> player to me. But since you know Ezra, uh, Big Q, and Brandon beat it in my head that it's, that it's the market out here. Okay, yeah. cool. I let I agree. It's the market out here. If you were a top fifteen quarterback, you don't get a hundred million dollars. Crazy as that sound, that's the market as that's the market today. And if you don't pay him, just like Big Q say, somebody's gonna pay him. Somebody gonna pay him. You got y'all tied up. But my question is, if you paying this man. A guarantee $67 million. And you're talking about build a team around him. What are you gonna well, how are you gonna build a team around him if you give him one person Thank all you. this money? Oh, you know, Thank you. somebody asked me on Twitter Bad. earlier today. Wait, wait, not, for, for, earlier real, today. for real. The, yes. They said that since 2011, Cam Cam Newton been sacked 587 times. Mm-hmm. How, you is, gonna, how you gonna was, how you gonna how you gonna just say it? If, He's the offense. Who else is gonna be able to get sacked when ain't nobody else got the ball? I'm just saying. But if you get that one man all that money, you can, he's not going to get a line. You know, you know how you build a team around him? It's through the draft. It's yeah. plain and simple. That's how, you, that's how Seattle's so good right yes. now. They're going to be good for a couple of years because they build – all their core players are, you know, draft young guys and their rookie deals and San stuff. San Francisco's like the same way. Very few teams win through free agency. Mm-hmm. So if you're going to win in this league, it's most likely through the draft, your core players. So – the Panthers need to draft well, get him an offensive line through the draft because so they can last with him for seven to eight years. Another wide receiver, a deep threat. you got to build through the draft. It's plain and simple. 
But that's, easier than, that's easier said than done, though. I, I know that was, that's why the great teams stay great, and you know, stupid right. organizations like mine d- don't last for too long. I agree, and that's why all I'm saying is, like I said earlier, I'm happy for um, for Cam. I think it was great for Cam. But if you're the Carolina Panthers, yes, I know it's it's what you um, you have to do this before someone gets to him. Yes. But my thing is, who is he going to throw to, or who's going to block for him? Who's going to run the ball for him? My thing is, it, it's not if it was that easy to uh, draft listen, like that. Listen, listen, listen right here. Teams, how many how many 20, Russian TDs? Twenty different teams will go to Super Bowl. How many Russian TDs yeah. and how many Russian yards did this man have last season? How much how much oh, Russian shit. yards did the Carolina Panthers running back core have last year? <laughs> Listen, everybody know the Carolina Panthers offensive line was one of the weakest points of, of the team. They addressed it. They got a few, pe- few pieces in. Byron Bell is out of here. They brought in Michael Orr. They did some things, right? It's Band-Aids. It's, it's Band-Aids. As far as weapons, wide receivers, hey, Kevin Benjamin proved his worth last year as a rookie. Brought in, we drafted, you know, uh, Devin Funches. Got Stephen here. Some, we, look, we got a nice little core of, of wide receivers. Still got, you know, the tight end, uh, Greg Olson and, and Eric, I mean, uh, Dixon. Listen, the offense is gonna be okay. They're gonna be fine. You know what I mean? It was just digging out of that free, I mean, out of that uh, that cap hole that Marty Herney put us in all those years ago that everybody keeps on forgetting about. It, we had to do what we had to do to get out of that, and so we go back it. in it. So, so you're going back in it, huh? I don't think so. I don't think so. My thing is, if you let Cam go. Right. What are you telling Panther Nation? Right. And where yeah. do you go from Absolutely. Yes. Who's Absolutely. Who's going to let him go? Oh, you know what? Cam's nothing. We're not going to give him $100 million, So we're going to go 1-15 in 15 this yes. year to potentially, hopefully, we find a guy. In the, how many first overall picks, top 10 picks, top 15 pick quarterbacks have been bust in this league? Yeah. I'm not mm-hmm. saying – like I, I agree. He's not a top five guy. I don't even – Cam Newton is probably not even a top 10 guy in my head right now. But he's a guy that you you can you know what you're getting from him, and you know he has time still to develop. Mm-hmm. You have to help him in that development, aside of the money. I you know I will go with the known than the unknown if I have a guy like Cam. I'll tell you one True. thing, Carolina they have to look no no look no further than their own division with the Falcons. The Falcons paid Matt Ryan all that money, mm-hmm. drafting horribly. Yep. Where have they been the last couple of years? So they're right. definitely going to have to start drafting good because. Again, I'm right here in Atlanta, and I've seen the Falcons strike out on free agent after free agent after mm-hmm. free agent. And, and draft it, it, you're, you're the when Scott Tisha of the NFL. You've got to have a team that's going to be able to draft well. If you Absolutely. Don't, right. yeah. You're going to be in the same boat that the Falcons are in. you got a high-paid quarterback. He's getting sacked all the time. You may have one you know, one or two high-potent offensive weapons. But other than that, you're, you're not going to have any depth because you don't draft well, it's, 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 it's going to be, a, it's gonna, it's gonna be real good or it's going to be horrible. It's gonna be yeah. Horrible. I, you know, I have a feeling, though, you know, I look at back, back on the last four or five drafts, I, I think, you know, this one is we still have to see how it pans out with Shaq Thompson and, you know, and, and David Funches and all, and all those guys. But, but with Cam and Starr and Luke and all the, you know, the, the drafts that we've had recently, I think they've been drafting pretty good under Dave Gettleman, in my opinion. As a Panthers fan, I'm saying, you know, mm-hmm. I don't know. You know what I mean? I'm just saying. What do right. you think about that, uh, Mr. Raphael? No, I agree. I mean, y'all made some great picks, but for some reason, it's not panning out on the field. Maybe because they're young. 12 and 4 didn't pan out on the field? No, 7 and 9 didn't pan out on the field. No, 7 and 9 didn't pan out on the field. Well, look, I get that. And the 12, but, but look, the 12 and 4 the was new, defense. The New was York Giants won a Super Bowl with that same record. What are you talking about, man? You but y'all didn't. My, I understand it. All I'm saying is, you, all I'm, this, is what I, this is my thing. Let's do like the Patriots. That you know how Brady does it. Give Brady some money, he gives it back. You give him some money under the table. What do you mean he That's gives it back? Money. He had a fifty million to give it back. This dude is true. The devil is in the details. Tom Brady ain't give back no damn money. He just restructures so he can get right. that money in the back end. Right. Right. Actually, if you look at it, if you look at the contract. Cam Newton actually saves the Panthers $1.6 million this coming cap year, and next year's cap hit is about $18 million, which is pretty reasonable coming to a, for, for a quarterback. Well, especially when you got I, like uh, – Maybe I'm a Jets fan and I hate – you know, I, I hear that Tom Brady's giving back money. <laughs> well, you, got, you got $21 coming – Twenty-one. you got $21 million dropping off the books from Charles Johnson, which that was some dead money that we, we're going to be getting rid of. You know, somebody will have to restructure. Who, who – who, uh, I don't know. I mean, but it, it, and I don't think it's going to hurt the, the team that bad, especially when you look at 
what's coming up. You know, Charles Johnson's deal is coming up. There's a lot of people coming up. We got a lot of dead money on the table. Uh, people got overpaid a couple years ago. We already got rid of D'Angelo Williams. He's out of here. They're freed up a bunch of money. I, I'm just saying, I think Cam's going to be fine. You know, I just think ha- keeping Cam here with what they've been building, we just need to go on the field and let them do what they've been doing, man. They've been playing well. Uh, you know, we had injuries and stuff last year, suspensions last year. And I ain't using that as no excuse, right? I'm not. I'm just saying those things did hinder the performance of the team last year. And, you know, on top of all that, the division was pretty bad, which gave us a little bit of, you know, we kind of crept in the back door to the, to the playoffs or whatever. We did that, right? And then we did play against a, a hobbled uh, Arizona Cardinals team, which gave us, you know, gave, gave Camus first, you know, I see you glad. I'm just, I'm just I'm saying. Just, hey, I'm just letting you go. That's just the I, way it went, right? I'm faces, but I'm glad yeah. you know. Yeah, oh, 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 I watch. You know what I'm saying? I watch. But, but I'm telling y'all, man, this is – Carolina I know you're cold. excited, bro. I know you're excited. <laughs> but what you said on Twitter today, yeah, Super Bowl pump your brakes, bro. I've been saying that for two months. Stop it. Stop it. That, we need to stop it. Why the stop it button, Glass? We need to stop it button. Right? <laughs> I've been saying it for two months, right? I'm just saying. We'll come back to this. <laughs> but I, I will say this, gentlemen. I will say this. <laughs> you have to understand. They made that move because, like my man said, Sam, what's, 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 what's you go, Bob? Diego. Diego. Okay. Diego. Diego. Diego, you th- like he said, NFC South, you got you have Drew Brees, you have Matt Ryan, you know. Now they just brought this little young buck in here named Jameis Winston. So <laughs> you have to score points. You have to, you know, be able to score mm-hmm. with this bunch. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So I understand it, but at the same time, it's just like, wow. I guess but, I'm I guess I'm more mad at the NFL. Right, G- yeah. right for the market. For, for the market, because the yeah. cutler was crazy. That yeah. was horrible. I mean, Stafford, like you said, like y'all mentioned, every quarterback except for maybe Tony Romo. And Flacco. Wait, hold on. No, Flacco Wait, won two. Tony Romo signed a $109 million uh, dollar no, deal. No, like no, no. What now? I'm saying, Tony Romo didn't play bad as far okay. as his numbers. But what I'm saying is, Flacco, remember, he won a Super Bowl. He played his contract out. He did. Everybody else got the big contract so, and get nothing. So Tony Romo can go 8-8 eight and eight and get a $109 million dollar deal. But Cam... Two back-to-back division titles grants him nothing. He gets no. no I don't credit. think he should have. But I'm just saying he played with, well. He played with well. All the stuff he had to go through. Are you serious? That sounds like a lot of hate to me, man. I'm, I'm just saying. Hey, Tony Romo denied for going eight and eight for the, for previous season <laughs> three years in a row, and then Cam's twelve and four, and then whatever we finished with last year, backing into the playoffs. However you want to categorize it, with all the stuff that was happening to the team, he ain't he ain't, he don't qualify for the same type of deal. No, because no, because Tony Romo had over a hundred. How many ratings. division championships does Tony, Tony Romo? Have? I understand that, but Tony Romo had over a hundred ratings. How many times have Cam Newton went over a hundred? Well, look, I like his stats. I like his stats, but wins and losses still tell the story here. I'm just saying, it's still the NFL we're talking about. Yeah, let me get it on my boy Tony Romo. I just want to put it. in. <laughs> he deserved that money. Got me a couple oh. fantasy championships. Speaking, okay. yeah, speaking of hundreds, <laughs> Cam, matter of fact. To be precise, Cam is 30, 31, and 1. Yep, 30, 30, 1, and 1. That's his record. Yes, it I'm is. I'm not mad at that because they had a bad team before. Yeah, yeah. They, they had bad teams. I'm yeah. not mad at that. But at the same time, though. after a 7 9 season, come on. A so 7 9 can season? Can he get paid for potential or what he done? Uh, yes, he's getting paid for potential. Uh, uh, yes. Mr. Controversy, you think Russell Wilson was on the Panthers last year? They're going to the playoffs? Does anybody think that? <laughs> yeah. No, absolutely yeah. not. No. Whoa, 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 no. no. Wait, no. Mr. Controversy, you said Wilson was on the Panthers. They was going to the playoffs last year. This is the same guy who Russell said. Russell is a winner. Russell but, Wilson but is the same guy. Oh, wait a minute. The Adam same Seahawks guy. Seahawks are winners. Oh I'm not going to no. go with just Russell Wilson no. is the winner here. Ain't you the same guy who said, oh, my God, Cam ain't got no weapons. So, you, so Wilson is there, and all of a sudden weapons pop up. <laughs> what happened here? What wide receivers? Hey, Cam hey, was Russell Wilson's receivers. No, we oh. no. That's not what Ezra said. Ezra said no. we swapping quarterbacks here, right? Yeah. I, now, I, if Cam if Cam was on the Seahawks last year, do they win the Super Bowl? Heck, mm. they wouldn't get to the Super Bowl. <laughs> you know why? Also, right. hey, because they got them short receivers, and he's he's overthrowing them like he yeah. usually do. Okay, I give yeah, you that. I'm just saying, yeah. Russell Wilson is a of winner. Course. And he's he, he got no time to, um, to set his feet with that offensive line. Yeah, that's true, too. <laughs> that's true, too. Yeah. True. 
Man, you know what? You you've been you spend way too much time in Atlanta. You listen to that crap that they, they speaking down there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Look, your hate for Cam Newton is just ridiculous right now. Well, it, honestly, it, honestly, it, though, I say this though. Honestly, Q, <laughs> Cam Newton is my guy. I mess with Q. I mess with Panther Nation. Yeah. But that's why I said I'm happy for him. Right. right, right. I'm happy for him, but still, I don't care who you are. If you go seven and nine. I'm not giving you a hundred million dollar contract. So, okay, Let's okay. After you went after you went twelve or four, then you so go what, seven and nine. So what? No. Glass, I'm, gonna go, I'm gonna go off what Glass says. Like, okay, you you the owner, you the GM, right? And based on the logic you just presented to us, right? You had a twelve and four season, then you had a seven and nine and one season or whatever we finished with. Um, you know, won a playoff game, blah blah. Contract time, right? You saying you want to get this man that kind of money? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Because Andrew Luck is not coming down the pipe. What, what are you gonna do? What you gonna do? Not give him a hundred mil. <laughs> don't let him walk. Don't, him don't, walk. Don't, don't let him walk. walk. Just don't let no. Don't let him walk. Yeah, right. Don't you let can, him walk. How you not gonna let him? If, if, if another team comes up, Jacksonville Jaguars. Uh, no, nah, not Jacksonville. Um, Cam, Cam not going to Jacksonville. Jets. Yeah, the Jets. Give up okay. hundred million dollars. Yeah, situation look like, but yeah, Gotta give it up, man. Cam went last in New York. In New York, with that. <laughs> we know that. Come on, let's be real. So he's not going there. <laughs> Was right. so he trying to tell me that, that that Cam would take whatever they gave him? If they gave him anything less than, I think his 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 ninety six was like his his that's where he was reaching, and they kind of exceeded it. But I, I don't know that for for facts. So I don't nobody take that the wrong way. But I'm just saying, thinking ninety six is probably where he was reaching at, right? Mm -hmm. So anything less than ninety million dollars, you think he would have accepted that, knowing what the market is like, no. knowing that Ryan Tannehill just got Ryan freaking Tannehill, right? <laughs> I don't even know how Andy Dalton, Andy Dalton, right? Yeah. Led the league interceptions. Like, I mean, I'm just saying, just saying, <laughs> just, just saying. Yeah, you I think hey, Jay Cutler with 54 million guaranteed. They had you know, hands tied, bro. Like, Let's be serious. You got a backup quarterback with 54 million <laughs> guaranteed. I'm the star over here in Carolina. You right. Got to show me the money. Right. The market will always. You could, just blame the other 32 yep. GMs. The That's other 32 GMs. Yeah. That's what you got to right. do. I agree. Yeah. I agree. So listen, Cam Newton got a hundred and some odd million dollars. Okay, you need to recognize that he got that. Okay, he 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 don't got paid that. He getting ready to show why he deserves. I'm it. happy for Cam. They, they I'm happy for the everybody get their money. Yeah. Right, Carolina kind of done proved that they're a relevant playoff team. You even you even said that yourself, uh, Mister Controversy on Twitter. You recognize them as a playoff team, right? Mm -hmm. Did you not? I, I go yeah, to Twitter. Last year, yeah, last I'm, year I recognized their playoff team. Okay, so. Yeah. They building something there. You don't let this man walk. You don't start from scratch, man. We're not going back to the to the dark days of Jimmy Clausen, okay? We're not doing it. Panther Nation refuses to do that. We got our guy. We are rolling with him just like Ezra and them rolling with Geno Smith. All right, man. Oh, I think another, man. Thing, I think another <laughs> thing, fellas, we got to remember about Cam is, is the mark from the marketing standpoint what he brings to the to right. the team. The jerseys, the stales, the butts in the seats. Oh, absolutely. Right. People not going to Panthers games if if Cam Newton is not. You know, absolutely not. So a lot of that money, they're gonna they're gonna recoup a lot of it on the absolutely. Back so, but you know, it's the league's most with that the league the league's most uh, scholared GM and Mr. Raphael right here, his team would be belly up in like two seasons. You know what I'm saying? They'll be looking like the '80 Saints, but <laughs> let let him keep pulling this track. All right, <laughs> I, I wouldn't have paid Color. Color wouldn't have got that money if I was GM. Right. Man, please. <laughs> please. I think that's why I'm hate. Okay, I'm gonna be real, everybody. <laughs> That's why I'm hating. I'm hating like that because we paid Color all that freaking money. He didn't do anything. Right, right, right. I'm, right, right. I'm, I'm, I'm mad at that. That's, all right, that's I, got, I got about a list of 11 quarterbacks, $100 million quarterbacks. You say yeah and nay if you, do, if you agree with the money, all right? Aaron Rodgers, $131 million. Oh, that's easy. Yes. 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 Yeah, forget Aaron Rodgers. Colin, Colin Kaepernick, <laughs> $127 million. Heck no. <laughs> okay. No. <laughs> no, I don't think so. Jay Most Cutler, that, <laughs> Jay Cutler, one hundred twenty-seven million. Wait, 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 Glad, wait, wait, wait let's see. I got a question. Are we talking about? Are we talking right now? Like since we know what happened, or are we talking when they got the money? When they, when they got their money. When they got the money, I agree with Kaepernick because he went to no. NFC Championship twice no. and a Super Bowl. No. His first two years starting. Don't let me get started with that. I mean, I mean, I be, look, Glass, I, I, I know, be, Q, Q, let, let it go, Q. Last how season, you feel about Kaepernick, man. I was good last season. Y'all, you said I'm saying. Hey. I know, I know. You okay. talk about Kaepernick hater. Woo! <laughs> I'm just saying. All right, I'm fall back. <laughs> Joe Flacco, 121 million. Quarterback, you don't hate on my quarterback. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait. What you say? Don't hate on my quarterback. I hate him. 
You gotta go back and look at some old table TV. Like, boy, boy, I, yeah, boy. you gotta look at some. Yeah, he been <laughs> spewing the hate on Kaepernick. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah. Uh, Joe Flacco, one hundred and twenty-one yeah. million. Definitely. But, uh, yeah, they he didn't have no choice. Super Bowl. I won't say definitely, but yeah. I, I, he yeah. won the Super Bowl. <laughs> okay. Yeah. They, they, oh, they didn't have man, no choice. Please stop with that. He won this. He didn't, The Ravens won the Super Bowl. No, not he, him. Won, he won in the playoffs. That was he played, That he was like on Bolden. That was Boston in that playoffs. But, <laughs> no, all right, whatever. Right. Right. Tony, Tony Romo, 120 million. That's no. right. Yes. Give my boys money. No, definitely stop not. It. Stop definitely it. not. No. No. Uh yes. Eli Manning, 107 million. Yes. Yes. Yeah, yes. You gonna say yes? You gonna say no to Roma, but say yes to Eli Manning? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you know why? Because Eli, Eli Manning beat the, the the Patriots twice. And he beat. He well, beat. Ah, oh, yeah. The defensive well, line didn't do it. That was Eli. Okay. I'm just saying. And <laughs> we to say Diego. Eli outside of the two Super Bowls, though, we really talking about him as a bust. Right. Yeah. <laughs> right, right, absolutely, I agree. absolutely. Hey, he showed up when it counted. There you yeah, go, right? Yeah. Matt Ryan, <laughs> Matt Ryan, one hundred four million. Yeah. Yeah, yes. yeah. You had to, man. Yeah. You, you had to because wait, man. Now you are gonna sit there and say we had to, but you won't say we had to with Cam Newton, right? Because Cam Newton don't have Julio Jones or Roddy White. <laughs> he, I mean, who's gonna talk to them re- receivers? That's all I'm saying. Who's gonna throw them receivers? Uh, so hey, man, really, I don't, I don't like him because you know, because he's a Falcon. But the dude put up numbers, man. He, he, right. Yeah, he does. I'm uh, questionable about, uh, questionable about that one. But it is. <laughs> Cam Newton, 103 million. What we all say? Yes. I'm cool with it. Ooh. Yeah. Cam, Cam Newton. Oh, yeah, I'm all right. I'm all right with it, man. I, yeah. I'm all right with it. You need to chill out, bro. <laughs> <laughs> and Drew Brees with a measly $100 million. Yes. Okay, yes. He, he proved yeah. he, hey, proof is in the put. Even though, you know, all there's right, a little asterisk go. beside his little Super Bowl win. I'm just saying. Asterisk. Yeah, wow. man. You know, maybe you remember what happened that season leading up to the suit. I'm just look, I don't know if I gotta keep refreshing y'all's memory on things. I'm just saying. Uh, Big Q. <laughs> I'm just saying. Bounty Gate, really? Yes. Come on, man. Yes. You can't be mad at somebody putting a little incentive on, on whooping people butt. No. I, 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 I get mad when that incentive involved by Steve Smith and Cam Newton. Yeah, I get it's personal at that point. <laughs> just saying, you know? Uh-huh. All right, cool. It's definitely personal. For real. Well. Let's go ahead and close shop on this because I think everybody agreed that Cam Newton got his money. Yes. To get his money. Absolutely. All I got to say, Big Q, tell Cam, clean up on his uh, accuracy because when he got pressure, he cool. When he don't have pressure and do come across the middle, yeah, there's problems getting it to well, you. You know, I, I ain't going to keep on being a dead horse. Y'all got to watch the film footage, man. You know, you know, when he broke all the records and stuff his rookie season, he came back that second season and wasn't doing all that stuff, but he was throwing the ball from the pocket, you know, mm-hmm. super accurately. Just saying, you know, we work on – it ain't Cam. It's the line we need to work on. Don't, get that pressure off Cam. Cam doing what Cam does, okay? Y'all hate. Right. No, we ain't hating. <laughs> we we, we keep it real, Big Q. Yeah, you know, right. this, that's kind of like – Yeah, right. Cloud just, nine right as an extra incentive – We've been drafting guys like Kelvin Benjamin and Devin Funches and these big body guys, right? So you say, you, look, this is what all I saw last season. I saw Kelvin Benjamin over uh, Richard Sherman and, you know, Maxwell and uh, whoever that dude was in Tampa Bay who Kelvin Benjamin broke his arm. All I see is him beasting cats in the, in the red zone. So that's all I'm saying. You can come and throw the ball away if you want to. Them boys going to bring it down. You know what, Big Key? You can say all you want, everything you want, but 79 hey, record says it all. It's in the film. Watch the film, dude. Watch right. the film. It's in the record. This is, this is my last statement on Cam. Now he yeah. got his money. Yeah. Can he please, please, for press conferences, get some socks? And some <laughs> yes, I, I agree. Uh, yes, I agree. Yes. I, I definitely agree with that. He got step. He got step his fashion game up. I have yeah. to agree with y'all. Yeah. Hey, hey, look, that you know his tie and jacket game is on uh, is on point. It's just yeah, pants below the waist. That's where we got problems. Yeah. yeah you know. He looking like hey. Peter, he looking like Peter Pan. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I, I'll end it like this, Q, and I'll be quiet. I, I'll leave Cam alone. Oh, no, I know this ain't over. No, it's not Cam. <laughs> it's not Cam. Maybe y'all should have spent $100 million on a quarterback coach. Because if he gets the right quarterback coach, it's a wrap. Man, Man that's a whole nother conversation for another day. You know what? Right. You, I can't wait to, like, I can't wait to the season start. We got three months, right? And I'm saying. I, I gave you a compliment. I'm just saying. Man, you know, Cam is straight, dude. And he going he gonna to bust y'all up. I'm just saying. We, no, we ain't got y'all. We already did that to y'all last year. We got to that. So, yeah, we ain't got y'all. <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right, y'all. We going to close shop here on this, man. want to thank you guys for joining in on the conversation. I'm going to go ahead and let y'all 
give yourselves out. Big Q, tell everybody where they can find. No, you know what, Big Q, we're gonna hold you for last because you are you got a podcast you gotta promote on this show. I, I do got a podcast to promote, but you know what I just did on the live stream though, which is weird. I you know I do it all the time. I have my mute button on, but I had to pull the footage from your channel to put back up here. But that's okay. All right, that's cool. Cool. Ezra, how everybody can find you, bro. You can follow me on Twitter at Idiot Sports Talk or check out the YouTube channel at Idiot Sports Talk. Cool. Mr. Ra- uh, Raphael, Mr. Controversy, how can we find you? You can follow me at Mr. Controversy 21, also at the Three Point Conversion. And you know you got to check us out. Glass, I know you better have it at the bottom of the screen. <laughs> Three Point Conversion Sports Lounge Podcast every Saturday morning, yes, 10 yes, a.m., 12 p.m. Eastern Time. It's live and it's real. Yes, sir. That's some good stuff. That's pretty Diego, good. Diego, how can we find you, man? I found you, but how can everybody else find you? <laughs> right. <laughs> you can catch me on Twitter at, at Al Yeager or at AA Sportscast. Also, look out for AA Sports Radio coming soon. Yes, sir. Nice, nice. Big Q. Yes. So, listen, tomorrow night, 8 p.m., here on YouTube, Team Boy TV Turbo. I send the links out on Twitter. You don't know far ahead of time. Uh, you can check me out on Google Plus on Team Boy TV Turbo as well. Black and Blue Podcast. We're going to be getting a little bit deeper into this thing without all these outside it, it, Panther Nation. This is for y'all. Okay. I do, I do the Black and Blue Podcast for my family. Okay. So we'll be getting together. We'll be talking about Cam's contract. We'll be talking about uh, future outlook for the team. Uh, we all feeling real good about the squad this year, y'all. And I'm saying, I know y'all ain't listening to us. We've been saying it, though. Carolina Panthers, man, up there in uh, Levi Stadium playing for that big thing. I'm just saying, y'all, y'all tripping. <laughs> y'all been trying to tell you. This is glass from Give. I'm, I'm cutting you off now. <laughs> this is glass from Give. the sports place where you get your sports with a little swag. You can find me on Twitter, Facebook, at Give with Sports. Check out the blog page at Give with Sports at WordPress.com. <laughs> on YouTube, Give with Sports 2. And in the near future, we will have more two cents deposits on sports because I feel something about little Caitlyn Jenner. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm like, yeah. Well, I guess it is sports related, right? You know, it is what, sports related. So, when he, yeah. he seen like Olympic, like, like, like monster back in the day? We don't say that for the, for that, for that oh, okay. episode. Uh, yeah. uh, mama coaching, named him Bruce. Yeah. Mama named him Bruce. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> and the coach of Carousel. We got a new coach, Fred Hoiberg, Chicago Bulls. Mm. Uh, new, Orleans Pelicans, new Orleans Pelicans have Alvin Gentry. We will be talking about that probably this weekend, but we'll see. But we got more stuff coming on two cents to positive on sports. But we're going to close shop here. And as always, on two, um, two cents to positive. As always, on Get With Sports, place where you get your sports with a little swag. We will always say be good, be safe, get with it. Peace. Peace.